Hello friends. So today topic is uh, like uh, play with uh, Kubernetes. Okay. So in this session, I will explain you like uh, if you don't have a system like laptop and desktop, and you are not able to set up your lab Kubernetes lab. So in that condition, you know, like uh, you can log into the play with Kubernetes portal, and then you can set up the lab. So that I'm going to show you like a step by step how you how you have to set up your lab. Okay. So this is my YouTube channel, Techla Knowledge, and uh, here you know like uh, that all basic uh, Kubernetes videos are available. So in the previous session, I explained about the Kubernetes basic command and uh, how to install, uh, like uh, how to set up a Kubernetes multi-node cluster and how to set up a single node cluster like Minikube and uh, architecture. So like, you know, basic videos are available. So I can request you go with this uh, video and uh, you can see the basic uh, things about the Kubernetes here. Okay, fine. Now let me start. So let me go to the my Firefox browser. So, and here in a here, what you have to do here, you have to open the Google and then you have to type here, play with Kubernetes, okay? Once you click here, so then you have to click here, the play with Kubernetes uh, link. This is the first link here. And here you, once you click, you will get this window look like this. And here you can see like uh, play with Kubernetes. So here you have to log in. So in a login, you can see there's two options. One is a GitHub and one is a Docker. So like, you know, if you have an account uh, like GitHub or Docker, then you can log in with that. If you don't have, then you have to create the account. So in my case, I have a GitHub account. So I uh, let me click here, GitHub. So, okay. So actually I provided all the details and now you can see uh, like um, it's like a start window I got here. I, I can see here, okay. So I have to click here in a start now. Okay, so like, you know, once you click here, start. So like, you know, so like now you can see it's showing the hair timing. So it's a total four hours. It will be like, you know, it will be give here. So total four hours means like, you know, once you start your lab. So it will be duration is a four hours. In a four hours, you can, uh, you know, set up your lab. After four hours, automatically that whatever you set up the lab and in a created instance, automatically it will be deleted. Okay, so it's a learning purpose, I can say, you know, one day it's enough for four hours. So you can set up your lab and then you can start your learning. Okay, fine. So here you can see it's uh, telling add a new instance. So let me click here. So once I click here, you can see instance is created here. So I in this lab, I will create uh, two instance. One is a master node, one is a worker node. So let me create one and another instance. So I created a two instance node one and node two. So let me click on the node. So node one is my master node and node two will be my worker node. So once you click here, you can see in a console, like there are lots of information you will get. So like no need no need to worry about like, you know, like uh, what is the command, how to set up. So everything will be in a display, in a display message, banner message you can see here. So, okay, one more thing. So I uh, open this, uh, you know, uh, play with Kubernetes in uh, my Firefox browser, okay? Because, you know, my in my Google browser, it's not working. In some system, in a Google browser, it's not working. In some system, in Firefox, is not working. So you have to check with a different, different browser, okay? So which browser is working? Working means, working means like, you know, you're not able to copy and paste from here, okay? So that is a working like, uh, so like suppose if you want to copy and paste, so that is not working in a Google uh, Chrome. So in a Firefox, for me, it's a working. So that's why you have to check with a different, different browser. Okay. So let me copy this thing in a notepad. Okay. Right mouse, right mouse click and copy. Let me open the notepad. Let me paste it here. Yeah, so now you can see like it's telling the initialize the uh, cluster node. So let me copy from here to here and let me paste. So when you, you know, if you right mouse click here, you can see now paste option is not getting, okay? So in that case, in some system, it will be work control V, uh, alt control 
alt plus control plus v and uh, some system it will work shift insert see in my system it's working shift uh, shift insert so let me press shift insert here so now you can see okay let me i think i not copy from the whole command okay now you can see i able to paste here so let me hit enter here so now in slicing we started here so you can see here is like it's giving in slice the cluster master node so this one you have to uh, run on the master node so this is my node one is my master node you can see here so now you can see its ip is this one it like uh, after some time you will get uh, some symbol here so we need to wait here it says start so you know like everything you will get here and uh, within uh, I, I can say minute you can um, set up your lab and then you can start your uh, practice okay okay so once you done then it's telling like initialize the uh, cluster network then what we have to do once uh, this command is done successfully then you have to run this command okay so this is for the network initializing the network let me copy this one also and this one uh, and this one also you have to run on the uh, master node so now you can see here see it's a symbol is coming right here so this is my master no master node here okay now you can see once you run this uh, these are the information you're getting okay so let me copy this one also first let me copy la nah, this one this this use this one you have to this one network i already copy i have already so let me copy this one because i will tell you what is this let me copy from here then you will understand let me paste it here okay so now i have to run first this one let me run this one first okay yeah so i'm going to set up the network here so it's done now you can see this one i have to run so then you after a network initialization you can see here then you can join uh, any number of uh, number of worker node means like uh, you know this command you have to run on the worker node suppose if you have one two three more than three so on the on the all the nodes this command you have to run okay now let me remove this slash and then copy so this one i have to run on the worker node so this is my worker node let me run here on let me go to the on my master node so if i run here cube ctl get so now you can see it's showing node 1 and node 2 so node 1 is ready like it's a like already like you know it's ready to like it's running node 2 still is not ready so we have to wait for some time so you, I, once I run this command here, you can see in a uh, worker node also it's showing here, like you know. Okay, it's still running. Okay, fine, no problem. Let me run the again this command. Now you can see it's running and running. You know, both the nodes are running. So this is my master node, and this one node two is my worker node. Okay, if you run here cube ctl cluster hyphen info okay sorry okay, okay so one second Okay, so I think uh, that command cluster cluster cctl cluster info that I have to check. I think some syntax problem here. Oh, what? Let me run the cctl help command here.
info 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 log cp so if you run this command you will get the details like you know like uh, whatever every like you know you will get the command details here so info okay fine like that that is a command like i will uh, give that command in a description okay now you know like you want to check the service what you have to do you have to run cube ctl and get service okay so you can see it's a service details are showing here if you run this command also uh, like you know cube ctl get svc the same output you will get okay like this is also the like you know we are going to list out the service okay now if you run the here cube ctl cube ctl get deployment deployments okay so no resource found you can see it's showing the no resource found so what we will do we are going to create one uh, deployment here so cube ctl and create deployment and then we have to give the here the name so i'm going to give a ng next and then hyphen hyphen image and which image we are going to use so we are going to use nginx again so here like a cube ctl create i'm going to create deployment and the nginx here you can give the any name okay as per your comfortable and like here hyphen hyphen image that you have to choose like which image you're going to use so once you run this command it will be download the image from the docker hub okay that docker hub like uh, it's a public repository once you run and uh, hit enter, you can see deployment uh, dot app nginx created. Now let me run the uh, kubectl get deployments. So now you can see it's showing one the like you know uh, nginx is uh, deployments is showing here. Okay. Now if I run here kubectl get pods. Okay. So now you can see one pods are showing here. Okay. So like, you know, like this way I can say like, you know, like you can set up your uh, cluster online if you don't have a system and laptop. So, and then you can start the practice. So I hope uh, you like this video. So thanks for your watching. Have a nice day.